victim mentality is a curse. And when you get, when you're around long enough, you realize it's not just liberals that are selling that victim mentality. It's, you know, the left and the right when it's expedient for them to further a certain cause. But I think liberals are more guilty of it, particularly not liberals, the left. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Guys, we're going to be reacting to Carlos Owen shut down the left victimhood mentality. Guys, let's get straight into this. Hi. Um, can you speak about how liberals control black Americans' mind and how um, black people are their worst enemy and about staying in the victim mentality? Yeah. The victim mentality is a curse. Yes. And when you get, when you're around long enough, you realize it's not just liberals that are selling that victim mentality. It's, you know, the left and the right when it's expedient for them to further a certain cause. But I think liberals are more guilty of it, particularly not liberals. The left, the far left lives in victim houses. Here's the truth. If you believe in your own victimhood, you will become your own oppressor. If you believe, woe is me, I can't get ahead, you will be shocked at the power of your own words and the power of your own mentality. Um, like I said at the beginning of this, psychology is key. And if they insert in your psychology that you can't, I can guarantee you 100% that you most certainly will not, right? And if you reverse that psychology and you say, I can, I can guarantee to you that you will. And it is the most harmful, it is, it is a death sentence on your life to just believe that you are nothing but a victim. It turns you into a whiny, angry, upset, can do nothing individual that nobody wants to be around. And that's why I say victimhood is a curse and to believe in your own victorship is a blessing. Sorry, I have another one. Um, also, what would you say to the black Americans that claim America is so racist, but yet they're killing their own people? Um, you know, I, the first thing that I would say to them is to get educated, genuinely. Just start somewhere, listen to someone who you hate, like me, for like one episode. I'm always like, just give me one episode, please. Pick up a Thomas Sowell book, you know, explore the other idea because it is, it is just such a lie and it is such a nonsense and it isn't just black Americans, it is all Americans. Like they've extended it from black Americans to all of these other victim groups that we're talking about tonight. And the more that you get into history, you realize that the issue was never black on white, tall on short, men on women. It was always the government trying to drive people apart. So True. education is, is the key to everything. True education. <laughs> Guys, that is so true, and I honestly believe that blacks killing yourself is, is upset, it's stupid, and it's ridiculous. You've seen it, like, when, when, if you listen to a, a black rap battle and you see my father was not there, had to teach me how to shoot a gun, black, why, why do you want to learn how to shoot a gun, bro? Like, what, why do you want to learn how to shoot a gun? Like, what is, what is it for? Like, how much are you getting? Let's say you start selling drugs and let's say you make on a good maybe you were good like 200k you buy a car you rent in a house with a gun and you get killed in like five years into the business or three or two years into the business like you're not gonna enjoy life bro let's say you have mm, with like 15 20 women and see that's not life like life is when you give birth like Life, I, I see life as something that you have to live, right? You, and time actually matters. Like, you can't just say you experience the whole of life in like 20, 25 years, 30 years. Like, you need to know what it feels like to be old, like what it feels like to be young, what it feels like to be at the mid. Like, you need to understand, watch your friends' children grow, watch your children grow, attend your children wedding. Like, you need to understand, like, me when I saw my grandmom, attending her granddaughter's wedding it was amazing like you seeing the smile on her face is something i will want to experience and for me to be honest i feel black people i think we're getting it right now actually based on the people with the help of people like candace owen charlie's cake like them actually installing in order we are not actually victims and i, I don't think I don't think I believe we are victims anyway. I don't think, maybe some black people think this way, but I, I really don't think I'm a victim of any circumstance. I believe that I am free. I believe that I can do anything as far as I put my mind to it. 
And I think everyone should have this kind of mentality when we move forward. But guys, always think about this. So just to like, share, subscribe to my channel. I will see you next time, guys. Best.